Hello everyone, War Dog Knife Sharpening here. Today we're going to be working on this axe. It's a hatchet head. I bought it used. The handle fell off it when I was sharpening previously. And I never did quite finish it, but now that I got that sharpness tester, this best certified tester right here, I want to sharpen my axe and check it. So... We are using our Tormek, it's the Tormek T8. And then we're also gonna be taking a look at this Tormek WM200. It's the angle checker. So right here tells you how much wheel you have on the aluminum oxide wheel that I'm using. So if you run this up here, it lines up right with the 240 millimeters is what it's what's written there. So I adjust my WM200 to 240 right here. And then once we set our ax on here, we'll adjust this side to get the angle right. So I think we we're running about a 45 degree angle on this ax head. We were matching the previous angle. And the way that we did that is we used a Sharpie to, to paint it up. So we'll redo it right now. Having the water. Okay, so now as we set this down on here, we're gonna wanna shift it. Because this is a, at a radius, I like to radius it instead of going straight across. Some guys will go straight across but with that radius on there, I like to swing the ax head. So I'm gonna put, make sure I'm firmly against the ax jig right here. I'm gonna set it down. Hopefully you guys can see that all right. So I'm gonna swing it. Right there, I'm getting that corner. Now I'm coming in from the side. I'm more getting the center of it. And now I'm heading to the far side. If you need to, slide your rail a little bit. Or slide your axe jig. If you're not ending up on the stone where you need to be, then slide your axe jig back and forth. Okay, so we got the camera over here a little closer. Let me angle it down just a little bit. So you can't really see, but right here it says 240, 230, 220, 210, 200, 180, 160. So what I like to do is put our angle gauge. This is the Tormek WM200. Here's a close up of it. So on this side, it set, I got it set to 240 degrees. And on this side, it's matching our angle on our axe. And we're at about a 44 degrees. So that's the angle we're running on this axe head that we got. And so the way that it works is you set your axe in here. Our axe would go down. So our axe is sitting in our jig and it's against the stone. And then the way that it works, this is the back side of it, but you'll still be able to see what I'm doing here. So the side with the 240 is right here. And the side with the angle, you adjust that to match the, the piece up here you adjust that to match the angle of your blade. So once it blocks all that light, you know you're at the right angle. So right there, we're good. So I've already tightened it down. And so we flip it around to see what we're running. And it's uh, 44 degrees. And then you can also take a look at those pieces on the top. These are the quick guide. 
so you just drop your axe into one of these and whichever one it fits in the best is the angle you're running so the 40 degree it doesn't look like it quite drops to the bottom the 45 it fits in there really good the 50 is a little loose so it looks like 45 degrees is going to be our closest in the five degree increments so that's how you use this angle guide we want to lay it flat on our axe jig Flat on our axe jig again and then lower it down. Okay, we're going to set the axe jig out of the way. So we can see our edges starting to look pretty nice. Flip it around to this side. It's looking pretty good. So let's take it to the stropping wheel. All right, so we're still working on this axe head. We're gonna check it in a little bit on the PT50A industrial. But right now we're gonna strop it on this leather strop wheel. It's on the Tormac T8. Okay, we worked that side a little bit. We're gonna flip over and work the other side. Trying to get it to focus in. Well, I think that's about as good as I'm going to get the focus to go. So let's go a couple more minutes on the strop and then we'll go to the sharp tester. So you guys just see me sharpen this right here. <coughs> Excuse me. But we just sharpened it on the Tormac and then we sharpened it on the leather strop at a 44 degree angle, which is not a real steep angle. Most people don't want to run 22 and a half degrees on each side. Every, most people are looking for a sharper angle on their knives or whatever, but even on axe heads but this we're running to 44 degrees which is so close to a 45 i'm going to set it back over here so it's out of the way and then we're going to see what the 198 is on our chart so 200 is showing utility razor blade so even though I'm running a 45 degree angle on that, I have it as sharp as a razor blade. 